the Krabby's Handicap Chase is next, 2.5 miles, 0 to 140, top 1 gigabyte, poor roads. Gemini Morning, Martin Lidham, Sympathy for the Devil, Molly Etzer, Surfer, Tainted Half, Stu Gray, Sins to Forgive, Joshua Sutherland, Petro Girl, Doug Warren, Ma Majesty Alex Cherry and Sea Valley, Doug Warren, only 8 then. And this one... Called in. And all standing still. And away they go. Right the way down towards the first. Look for fences. And the Doug Warren pair of the first two to show Sea Valley and Petro Girl. Oh, sympathy for the devil. The rest of them all in the line as they go to the first of 15. And they've all got safely to the other side of that one with Petro Girl just the leader. Sympathy for the devil on the near side. Early back marker is Gemini Morning as they make their way down towards. The second. Sympathy for the devil in front. Petro Girl. Gemini Morning now moving up on the outside. It's coming right through to take the lead. And joined by Tainted Half. They're all that keen to lead it would seem as they shuffle it about as they take that big ditch and they're all over that one safely. With just about Petro Girl in front now from Gemini Morning over on the far side with Tainted Half. Gigabyte closest to us. Then Sins to Forgive. Majesty's next to that one. Sympathy with the Devil's drop back just a little bit in the back marker now is Sea Valley. As they race into the final two miles. Petro Girl just in front. Gigabyte on the inside second. Bit of a gap back to Gemini Morning, Tainted Half and Sins to Forgive. Sympathy with the Devil, virtually four in a line. And Sea Valley and Majesty the Grey is the back marker. And down towards the next then. These fences look big. Not particularly stiff though, they all got over that one okay. With Petro Girl in front. Rest of the field pretty tightly packed, and then Majesty just the back marker. As they make their way right handed and towards the next. And Petro Girl comes to this ditch in the lead. All over that one, okay. Sympathy for the Devil was slow on the inside. But Petro Girl still the leader by about two lengths to Since to Forgive in second, then Gigabyte. Gemini Morning, Sea Valley, Tainted Half. Take the sixth and all oh, mistake at the back there. Oh, Majesty and Gigabyte both made slight errors. That Petro Girl is still showing the way as they come to the seventh. Gemini Morning turned to Wallop Bottle. And a bad mistake then has dropped right back to last. Plenty of time to make up for that mistake. Not even at the halfway point jump wise. Uh, Petro Girl's in the lead by length. Two sins to forgive in second. So they take the water. Past the winning post. Complete circuit to go. And for the first time, Petro Girl has been headed by Sins to Forgive. So Sins to Forgive takes it up then. Only by half a length though. Petro Girl is in second. And Gigabyte is now going okay again. Sympathy for the devil on that one's inside. Then Sea Valley and Majesty together and Tainted Half. And Gemini Morning are almost together at the back as well as they take the next. And Gemini Morning jumped that one particularly well and went past Tainted Half. But Pet Petro Girl's got back into the lead again. The business end of the race as they race into the final mile. And Petro Girl leads by a couple to Sins to Forgive second. And there's a big gap of six lengths to the rest of them, just about headed by Gigabyte, but they're in a bit of a clump. And Petro Girl is in front, coming into this ditch. Over that one, they go. There's a fall there, something's down. It's Gigabyte's gone. So Gigabyte's made a few mistakes, and finally pays the price. And he's out of the race then as they come down towards the 11th. And over that one, they go. And Petro Girl continues to lead. Got four more fences to take. And Petro Girl leads by three or four lengths. Two sins to forgive in second. Then Sympathy for the Devil and Gemini Morning. Then Tainted Half. Then Majesty. Sea Valley just the back marker. And Doug Warren first and last at the moment. As they come down towards the fourth from home. And Petro Girl. Has been up in the van all the way. And leads. Oh, Gemini Morning's gone this time. Now that one's out. Unship the pilot. At the fourth last, and Petro Girl's the leader from Tainted Half now coming through to challenge. Then comes Sympathy with the Devil in third. Big gap back to Sins to Forgive, their Majesty and Sea Valley. Looks like it could be between these front three as they take the third last. And Petro Girl lands in the lead, Tainted Half, and then Sympathy for the Devil. These three are a good eight lengths clear of, of Sins to Forgive, who's trying to run on. They've got two more to take, two more fences to take. Tainted Half in the inside of Sympathy for the Devil. Then Petro Girl, the long time leader, they're clear, but now Sins to Forgive. Is trying to run on. It's tainted half coming out of the 
final fence in. This tiny time up the final fence. Lands in the lead, but Sympathy with the Devil is a bit stronger. Then Petro Girl seems to forgive, trying to catch him up, but it's Sympathy with the Devil. He looks like he might take it. Tainty Half is trying to close into the final half furlong. Sympathy with the Devil by half a length. He's got a hold on taking. Towards the line. Sympathy with the Devil wins it. Tainted Half is second. Petro Girl third. Seems to forgive fourth. Then Sea Valley was fifth. And Majesty was the last one to finish. So. Petro Girl left for most of the way. Finished in the money but didn't quite hold on. And Sympathy with the Devil takes it. For Molliet Surfer. Here it is then. Sympathy with the Devil is the winner for Molliet Surfer. Taking half was second. Petro Girl third. Sinister give fourth. And Sea Valley was fifth.